All right, new material with some new rhythms here. And what we have here is basically kind of practice for that. So what do I mean? So the A5 chord has its, gets its own rhythm right here. And then we go to the F5, that has its own rhythm. The G5 has its own rhythm. It's G5. The C5. The C5 has its own rhythm. This G5 has its own rhythm. We do go back to an F5 for another new rhythm. And then this E5 gets its own rhythm. So then we do basically the same thing. But instead of playing the same rhythm for two bars, we only play it for one. So a little bit more challenging for the last part because you got to change rhythms and chords uh, faster. So... Actually, for this one, I want to do this. I'll play it at half speed, then 100, and then play it a bit faster in case you'd like to try it faster. But yeah, change the tempo in Guitar Pro so this way you can set it to whatever tempo you like. So, very important and helpful. Count along as you play. So this way, well, it's just easier in the long run. So here we go. Nice and slow. Yes, I'm going at 50 on this guy. One, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, four, one, and two, and three, four, one, two, and three, and four, one, two, and three, and four, one, two, three, and four, and one.